Friends, welcome to my workplace for hands-on FACO and SICS training. Let us observe this totally unedited surgery. After instilling few drops of forbidden iodine over the ocular surface, the ocular surface is thoroughly irrigated by ring lactate or BSS. And now, the main incision. This is a triplanar incision with a 2.8 millimeter steel keratome. And now the anterior chamber is filled up with 2 percent hydroxypropyl methyl cellulose. A side port is made on the left side of the main incision. The microscope being used is OMS 90 from Topcon and the FACO machine is Oatly Catrex 3. Now, capsular excess. A uterita forceps is being used to raise a capsular tag. This capsular tag is guided anticlockwise all around to get an adequate size trexis of about 5.5 millimeter. Now, hydro dissection is done with 20, 27 gauze cannula and bases. The nucleus is tapped and the nucleus rotates. Now, antechamber is filled off with visco again and now I am going to divide the nucleus with a pre-chopper. The pre-chopper and a sustainer and the nucleus is divided into two heminuclei. It is the nuclear mass is rotated 90 degree and on more movement and the nucleus gets divided into four pieces. So, this is divide by pre-chopper and conquire. And now, our job is to go remove some superficial cortex, hold each nuclear piece bevel sideways and emulsify and remove the pieces. Ultrasonic energy is set at 60 percent, flow rate is 45 ml per minute and vacuum is 450 millimeter of mercury. This is Oatly Cataracts 3. This is the nucleus and now this should not be tried by new surgeons, experienced surgeons may try this. This is removal of cortex by the handpiece itself. Yes, most of the cortex has been removed. Some cortical fibers are there at 3 o'clock I am taking a Simco cannula to remove those fibers. And some fibers are sticking to the posterior capsule. And now, what is hydropolish? Hydropolish means uses of only the irrigating probe for polishing. The irrigating probe is introduced and it is tilted 90 degree and it is swept over the posterior capsule and all the cells that stick to the posterior capsule is gets dislodged and comes out. And now this is hydro implantation. Implantation of the intra intraocular lens keeping the anterior chamber maintained by hydro that is BSAs or ring elected. The lens is in the bag, it is dialed by the irrigating probe itself. A Sinsky hook is not required most of the time. And now the surgery is done, we just have to close the side port, 
by stromal hydration. Moxie has been injected into the anterior chamber and this is our final lavage of the anterior chamber. The anterior chamber is nicely formed and the case is concluded. Integrity of all the wounds are checked, few drops of moxie is applied over the cornea and the case is concluded. Thank you very much for your attention. Hope this video will help you in developing your surgical skills. Be a great surgeon and serve your patients with love, respect, empathy and great surgical competence.